where residents of Etokrom and surrounding communities are enduring frightful moments, crossing a temporary bridge linking communities. We do understand that people are risking their lives to attend school. The bridge collapsed about a year ago. After several appeals by resident, the government approved the construction of a permanent bridge. But work on the project has come to a standstill. The project site has been submerged in floodwaters. School children are worse affected. We passed here yeah, a long way. When we passed here, we don't reach to the school early. I feel scared. Because when you are walking here, like that you fall inside the river. A grieved resident expressed their frustration. The construction of the bridge has taken too long and it is affecting our livelihood. Residents are demanding speedy completion of the project. Is that indeed very risky for pupils? I should think so, particularly young people at their age. Some of them may not walk carefully. They may slip and fall into that water. And we pray that it doesn't happen. The, the assemblies are there. We expect them to react or respond to this situation and even put, I think, barristers on the edge of the bridge. I'm sure it will help the young children, even elderly people, to walk across yeah. safely. 